What up, YouTube? It's your boy King Pookie coming to the house with another talking about the Bears versus the Minnesota Vikings. Man, the Bears beat the Minnesota Vikings 33 to 27 to keep the Bears into the hunt for the playoffs. Man, we still we no need help. We need these two. You know, the Cardinals lose two games. You know, the last two remaining games in there. But, um, you know, but we needed this victory win. If we wanted a weak intention to make it to the playoffs, you know. Um, so, man, but here's the scores. It was 33 to 27. Mitch Sherbisky had 15 completions, 21 attempts. Um, he had, um, 202 yards and one touchdown. And David Montgomery, he had 32 carries, 146 yards, an average of 4.6, and he had two touchdowns. And then Allen Robinson had four yards receptions, he had 89 yards and zero touchdowns. And you know, and I know Derek. Darnell Mooney, he's, you know, he made a touchdown and he, he, he was picked in the fifth round and he's he's playing like a superstar, you know. And, um, but yeah, I don't know what's going on with this defense of, you know, um, they just haven't been the same. You know, they've been carrying the Chicago Bears like all the time and now they're he's like, the offensive is clicking, and you know what? They still the Bears. They better fire Matt Nagy because he was not making any of the play calling. No, it was all Matt Bill Lazers. You know, so, so I don't want Matt Nagy to take the credit for it. You know, because you know all because if you were ran the ball, and you know if they would have never. Bet Mitch Trubisky in the third game of the season. Maybe we could have been it to the playoffs. We could have been in the playoffs. But I don't know who was the one who decided if it was Manday and Ryan Pace to bench them. But you know who you know and I mean Man Nagy he wanted his man he wanted that statue Dick Falls and you know and he was just like a statue man. And we lost six games in a row, you know. And who knows how far Mitch would have got. And you know what? Mitch finally used what he, you know, he finally used his legs because he almost scored a touchdown, you know. ran He almost ran for a touchdown, you know. Uh, if, he, if he would have used his feet more often, we could have, you know, we could be probably winning more games, you know. To like Lamar Jackson when you know he you know if he doesn't see what the, the play you know somebody you know down the field he will just run the ball and make the goal for, goal for the touchdown you know and you know and he has to make the, the decisions like so fast so um but yeah I don't know what happened to the defensive you know man the defense is like they um bailed out the Bears like in the beginning of the season and the offensive was terrible and you know what the offensive is clicking and I don't know if this is because you know the defense is all banged up because Khalil Mack he is injured and I don't know why he's still playing you know they need him if they want to make it into the playoffs so they maybe they should have sat head down I know they got Lost um one of the draft um Dex Shu Shu Du Shelley I think he got injured and Jalen Johnson he was out you know uh, but and then um so but yeah I hope to God they still fire Matt Nagy at the end of the season because you know what these play callings was not Matt Nagy and I hope to God. Matt Nagy doesn't take the credit for this because he, it was 
He he we would run the damn football. We could have gone we're far. A lot of these top football teams, you know, they have a cool you know, have a running game, you know. So you, they used to run the ball. So and you know David Montgomery, he's a beast, you man. You saw that he scored two touchdowns. You know, this guy has a all potential to be a big start in the NFL, you know. If you if Matt Nagy would have gave him more carries, but um yeah, so next weekend we're gonna go against the Jacksonville Jaguars. Hopefully we'll beat them, but we don't know. Do look at the Jets, the Jets. Can you believe that they finally won a game against the Los Angeles Rams, you know? So we have to put, you know, don't let our guard down. We have to get that win. You know, no matter what, if they had, you know, they're a sucky team, we, we can't let, let our guard down. We have to go for the throw and go for the W, you know. Um, so hopefully we could, well, as I said, win against the Jaguars. Hope, hopefully, you know, when we play Green Bay, they will already clinch the number one seed. And they don't have to play for anything, so they'll probably play their second start, you know, second uh, starters. And they want to play their, their start, open starters, you know, this, so they sit them out because then, you know, the play for the playoffs. So who knows, you know. So, and you know what? Mr. Trubisky has never been the Green Bay Packers, you know. And... You know, now we have this time, and you know what? I hope to God they do fire Ryan because do you really trust him to draft another quarterback or draft somebody for the O line? But you know, this has been terrible, you know. And um, so, but I don't know if they're gonna keep Mitch Trubisky at the end of the season and give him a contract or he's gonna or franchise tag him or something like that, but. Yeah, who knows if we if we played like this in the beginning of the season, we could have got somewhere far, you know. But now we had probably have a good draft this year, you know, since we um for the Khalil Mack trade. Now now we have a number one pick, so but we you know. We st I hope to God that they still fire Ryan Pace and Matt Nagy. So this is, so this is King Pookie. Give me a huge thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel and join and turn on no those notifications and tell your friends to join the King Pookie Nation Army because we're getting strong every day, man. Because I have the best content. I talk about the Bears. I talked about Mandalorian and I'm going to be talking about WandaVision. So watch out for those videos. So yeah, this is King Pookie and I'll see you guys in the next video.